from visitmysmokies.com, it's the Funcast. And I'm your Smoky Mountain meteorologist, Paul Poteet. Look at me. I've got a glow about me. I've got a glow and a musical show. In our latest update from visitmysmokies.com, let's go for the glow first. This is happening on Saturday, and it involves very large and colorful balloons. It is something that's going to light up the sky in a summertime spectacle. Professional balloonists will be there in the evening of Saturday with a beautiful balloon glow and spectacular tethered rides. All kinds of colors against the backdrop of the Smokies. At sunset, beautiful, in beautiful Townsend, Tennessee, at the Townsend Visitors Center. They've got family-friendly activities and live entertainment, stuff to drink and stuff to eat also. The Gatlinburg Songwriters Festival is the big musical show that's going on around the area this week. That involves a three-day musical event and conference in and around the Great Smoky Mountains. That's Thursday through Sunday. Nightly performances by number one hit songwriters in all kinds of different places, like Gatlinburg, Old Red, Park Vista, Skylift Park, the historic Gatlinburg Inn, uh, the Listening Room in Pigeon Forge. And speaking of the Listening Room, which is one of the locations for the Gatlinburg Songwriters Festival, we have a recent story about it. It's in the travel tips section of Visit My Smokies. Dot com, all about the listening room at the Mountain Mile in Pigeon Forge. It's right off the Riverwalk Greenway. It's next to the Burks Outlet. It's across from REI. It's got a full-service kitchen and two full-service bars, huge cocktail list, American food, so a great place to go for music, food, and drinks. There's a lot of other things going on at the Mountain Mile, too. The Mountain Monster Ride, a drop tower to make your heart pound called the Monster Fall. The Monster Drive and Monster Launch are two other exciting rides you can experience at the listening room. And if you listen closely enough, I think you'll hear rain (laughs) from time to time this week. The remnants of Fred added into the uh, mix here. That would likely affect the Smokies most on Tuesday night into Wednesday. But we've still got chances of showers and storms every day this week. Uh, The wettest days, probably Tuesday and Wednesday. High temperatures, for the most part, will be in the mid to upper 80s, not quite as hot on Tuesday. And our nighttime lows will be into the upper 60s. So you'll have to double-check the Doppler on many of those days. Maybe plan some of your activities in the morning before thunderstorms get going in the afternoon. That looks like the kind of pattern we'll be in later on this week. And don't forget the indoor fun that you can check out when you visit mysmokies.com.